Safe, affordable, and routine access to space. That's what we see. Right now, it's about $10,000 a pound to get to space. We need to get that figure down to hundreds of dollars per pound. And though we're already launching the safest flights possible with modern technologies, we need to, to improve, improve that safety record dramatically to make space travel as safe and routine as modern aircraft. We need new alternatives to conventional rocket propulsion systems ones that will enable us to reduce overall vehicle weight and make room for more science payloads, and eventually for passengers. In short, what, what we need are new propulsion solutions, ones that enable us to move freely through the atmosphere and beyond it, to conduct commercial enterprises in orbit and scientific exploration in space, to travel throughout the solar system at will, and one day to journey beyond it. New vehicles, new propulsion technologies, a new paradigm. These are the goals of the Advanced Space Transportation Program. Take a look. NASA's Hypersonics Program may be the best means of meeting America's third generation reusable launch vehicle goals. Part of the Integrated Space Transportation Plan, NASA's third generation initiatives intend by the year 2025 to reduce launch costs to just $100 per pound and to cut risks to the vehicle and crew by a factor of 1,000. These initiatives will build on NASA's second generation reusable launch vehicle program, which will take our first steps towards those goals by the year 2010. By the year 2025, rocket-based or turbine-based combined cycle engines could power vehicles like these, drawing air from the atmosphere to ignite their onboard propulsion systems. Capable of launching from any airfield, 90-minute shipping to any point on the globe, affordable passenger flights for tourism and business, plus the ability to deploy satellites and deep space probes, continuing our science and discovery efforts in space. Technologies like these could revolutionize worldwide transport and provide a delivery platform for cheap, rapid access to space. Imagine electric thrusters that could operate in space, not just for minutes, but for years. Imagine space sails powered by sunlight or by the natural magnetic forces of the universe capable of sending spacecraft to the very outskirts of the solar system. Imagine permanent orbiting tether systems, space tugboats, that could move satellites around in orbit or send probe vehicles on their way toward distant destinations. As we seek to unlock the secrets of the cosmos, we face unique challenges that can only be overcome by developing alternative propulsion technologies such as these. It is the mission of NASA's in-space propulsion program to enable faster access throughout the solar system in order to permit rendezvous with orbit and long duration exploration of planets, satellites, and other bodies in our solar system. To reach our goals, NASA partners with government, academics, and industry. The leading propulsion, manufacturing, and design engineers in the nation. Over the next 20 years, we seek to overhaul the conventions and overcome the obstacles of 20th century space flight.
Together, we're rewriting the standards for space travel, for commerce, for exploration, and discovery. We are the men and women of the Advanced Space Transportation Program. Welcome to the future.